Well, sometimes as a footballer, you have to get used to playing in a downpour. That should be the case this evening. The rain has been lashing down. I'm Derek Ray, and with me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And we're focusing on live action from Italy's top division, Serie A. This should be high intensity stuff, Lee. Yeah, really looking forward to this one, Derek. Excite me. Come on, let's see some entertainment. And number 24, Alessandro Florenzi. And the lineup for the home side. I'll tell you what, you don't see this formation every day of the week. No, I mean, it looks very attack minded with the three up front, the three in midfield supplying the width as well. But I'm a little bit worried about the three centre backs. Will they get exposed in the wide areas? Inter's lineup is as follows. If you like wingers, you'll love this league. Yeah, absolutely. I love to watch a winger play, especially with pace and power. The central striker will stay more or less in front of the goal. The support will be provided by the three central midfield players. The back four is pretty conventional, but fullbacks will be asked to support from behind. From one side of the pitch to the other. Spinazzola. There are two. Extremely sloppy in possession. You know, as good as his goal-scoring record is, I think many people still underestimate Edin Dzeko, but what do you expect from him in this game, Lee? Well, basically, you've got to keep him out of the box because he's got such a brilliant finishing ability that you give him half a yard, he will score. So keep him as far away from your goal as possible. And space here on the flank. Intended for Jekko. What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. Well, here's the replay, Derek. I love a ball into the box. You know that. It's a beauty. And it's all about the time he allows himself by being patient, waiting for the ball to drop and then volleying with such precision. One nil then. Ranocchia. It's with Chalhanolu. Brian Tristante and return to Pedro and whipped into the box good tackle an opportunity to add to their advantage but not taken it was worth an effort wasn't it too much space was given to him takes the shot on
Brozovic. Now Brozovic. Martinez. And they've given him too much space. And this is Brozovic. Really good challenge. Martinez! Oh, he's missed it! Oh, a goal behind Derek, and he's missed. It's a big miss. Better two. And he's going to be disappointed with that pass. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. The hosts are struggling in terms of possession, but again, we've seen it before, we'll see it again. Their counter-attack play has been absolutely fantastic. Pace really hurts defences, and they've got that in abundance. Got a two. On to Dzeko, and able to close down the shots. Lukaku. Now Brozovic. Barella. Dzeko. Lukaku. It's with Florenzi. Well, the stoppage time situation, one minute here. Florenzi, well, can they exploit the space out wide? And space for the cross, well cleared away. And so it is, the first half story has been written. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, you're right, he has played well, and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. So, back underway, with Inter looking to find an effective route back into the game. Chalanolu. The ball with Martinez. Lukaku. And that puts them in position. Just couldn't get it through. Now the pressure being exerted. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. Played into the center of the box. And the struggle to get it away properly. Well, he's outplayed and outthought him. been given away by Lukaku Inter have given away possession Chalanolu it's a good Inter move in the making dangerous looking attack now he must favour the cross Well, he stopped them just when they looked menacing. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Dzeko. 
Lorenzi on the ball. As clean as a whistle, that challenge. De Frey. Barella has it. Brozovic. Ivan Perisic. Romelu Lukaku now. Keeping the ball moving. Crisp tackling. Dzeko. Lorenzi. Can they create something from here? So, 20 minutes to go. I'm giving the ball away. Well, as we see, Inter in control of possession here, but it's just whether they can convert that possession into clear-cut chances. You sense they need to pick up the pace a little, start utilising the wide areas more. The back line's doing a decent job. Hopefully the forwards can do that as well. Martinez. Opportunity here. Well, the keeper committed himself. An opportunity then for the Nerazzurri from the corner to get right back into the match. Con il numero 12, Stefano Sensi. Dentro, con il numero 5, Roberto Gagliardini. Now the delivery. Insufficient accuracy as regards the corner. Failure to hold it there on Pedro's part. Lukaku. And tidily played. Well, he's been ruled offside. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Pedro. Checo. No play stopped. It is a free kick. He's now got to be extra careful. A verbal warning rather than a caution here. Yeah, the next one, he knows where he's going in the book. Matias Bessino. C'è un cambio nelle file della formazione di casa. Esce dal campo. And going short with it. Numero 23. Well read to ease the pressure. Now can they counter clinically? Just listen to the fans here, Derek. They've just kept their noses in front, and these fans are doing their best to push them to the final whistle. Wanted to keep it, but couldn't. Lukaku. Perisic with the ball. Might be able to set up the chance. Difficult to stop him. And at this late stage, too, an opportunity for them to level matters. And in the event, just a talking to, but could easily have seen yellow. Well, here it is again, it's a lovely penalty. Deceives the goalie, sends him back in and slots it home. Even Steven won a piece on this match. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. And given the situation, a goal at this stage might well turn out to be a winner. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time.